Hello. How are we? Hello, Kit Kat. Hello, Gim. Hello, Dav. Hello, Mace. How is everyone? How is everyone? Unfortunately, I'm still sick. I was hoping. Jump scare is crazy. That's that's pretty crazy to say. What's up, Josiah? No, no, I'm not watching it. No, I get it. I get it. You can just be mean to me. I'll just sit here and take it. That's whatever. You can just beat up on me. I'll take it. Whatever. Hello, Steel City. I would have went live like 10 minutes ago, but I got stun locked in Discord, so... I signed up for this harassment. You're actually so true, so true. So true and right. I'm looking mighty fine tonight. Hey, thank you, I appreciate that. I haven't played Rocket League. I didn't play any video games yesterday. Literally, like, I obviously didn't stream last night. I straight up, like, once it hit, like, I don't even know. Once I knew I wasn't going to stream, I, like, took a shower, like, got ready for bed, and I didn't play any Rocket League or anything. I just laid in my bed. I watched Mob Psycho until I fell asleep, and then that was it. <laughs> Hi, Louie. I will never watch that video now, just as a grudge. For being real. I did not see your clip. I can check it out real quick, though. Uh, I decided because Mob Psycho is so short, I'm just going to do a complete rewatch. So I'm on episode six right now. Show everyone, please. <laughs> Lowering players are so funny. New players are so funny. Ooh, that was a good shot, though. That was a good redirect on that first one. Honestly, I think we all be needing that mace. All right, I'll, sh I'll show these two clips for you. The quality of these clips is always destroyed by, like, gift your game or whatever. And it's, it's so bad. I'm sure Discord doesn't help either. <sighs> nice, little Ariel. Little Errol. I see you. I'm picking up what you're putting down. Ooh. Ooh, a little breezy flick? That's actually the peak of your life. That's the peak of your life. That's a good shot. It's a good little redirect.
Dude, didn't. What is, what is the title of that clip? First breezy. That's literally your peak. <laughs> <laughs> this is not even an exaggeration. It's literally your peak. It's your first breezy ever. Just because something's peak doesn't mean your peak doesn't get higher. But it's literally your peak. This is some rave ass music. You actually shit on Existence so hard. That was crazy. It's not even a disc, Grogni. Yo, what's up? Can I call you T Swizzle? Can I call you T, T Swizz from now on, Christino? Oh, I know that shit felt good. I know that shit felt good, Louie. No? Why can't I call you T-Swizz? What's wrong? What's the problem? <laughs> What's the problem? That sounds racist. How? How could that ever sound like... <laughs> Can you elaborate maybe? Any, uh, piggyback off that, perhaps? Net spend, nugget, cash, net spend, or Claro lover. Are those all your alt accounts? What's up, cow? That's crazy work, Dav. Hell yeah, that's what it's all about. I haven't played Rocket League since I streamed last, so. That's, that is a, cr that is like, that is a, a reach, you're reaching to fucking Mars right now, that's wild. That's a crazy reach. <laughs> Christino, every time I've offered to play the last like two times, you freaking turn me down. Now you want to play? I don't really like Poke. Like, I don't know. I'm not really a big fan of the Pokemon card game. You're not playing good, so I don't care. I ask you to play because I want to play with you, not because you're playing good. Where is Anu? He was here. He was here the other day. Losing is not fun. How do you know he would have lost? I was low as fuck, bro. I was like... I was asking you to play when I was like 1500. Like, we would not have been losing every game. Me getting in lobby. If I got in a lobby with Gim, that would mean I dropped to like fucking champ to you, bro. Meet my friend J Dog. Okay. <laughs> bro. T Christino, T Swizzle. It's literally <laughs> You're going for you're going for like a five hundred mile reach right now, bro. Like give me a break. <laughs> what the fuck, bro? Gim has more mechs than me? I've hit more breezies than Gim. It's a funny reach. Yeah, honestly, as long as it's funny, it's okay. That's the rule for anything. Anything goes. 
As long as it's funny, anything goes. I burn Christian clapped your ass in ones. I don't recall. Christino just has no confidence. Hi, Hannah. How are you? Dude, I hate having, like, my sinuses and shit blocked. Every time I get sick and I can't breathe, I just think about when I could breathe. Good night, Kit Kat. Appreciate you. Love you. Confidence is for losers. I guess so. No, I don't remember saying I would join Quagsire Queens. Oh, if isn't if it isn't the sissy himself, Ivan ate pie. No, I don't hate you because you're a man. I hate you because you're. Um, Actually, yeah, you're kind of right. Yeah, I mean, some weed has a really strong smell. So, that makes sense, Steel City. I'm just keeping it real. I'm just keeping it real, Grogny. I'm just keeping it a buck fifty. Bro, Steel City is like 17 and has never smoked weed in his life. You're gonna rip some wonderful bulls. I will not be joining you. Smoking when I'm smoking when you're sick just feels horrible. Yes, I outsmoked Snoop Dogg. Oh, hello, Cross. This is where I call you a pussy, bro. Smoking is not enjoyable when you're sick. It just isn't, unfortunately. That's why I'm gonna overdose on NyQuil later tonight. Y'all know I'm right. Smoking when you're sick is not comfortable. Nah, Shalee, okay, Shalee is actually a pussy. Shali doesn't smoke with me at all. Well, to be fair, I did just not smoke for like four months, but Shali doesn't smoke with me at all anymore. I remember back in the day when I was doing ketamine in the high school bathroom. That's true, Jordan. Shalee's a bitch. Shalee, Shalee actually hasn't smoked with me for so long. She's such a pussy. Like, what are you afraid of, you fucking coward? You turn October... Oh, so you just turned 17. Uh, no. I feel like I... I just know for a fact that, like, cannabis under the age of 25, there are studies linking it to, like, potential, like, brain development issues. So, I probably, I probably wouldn't recommend it. Anyway, yeah, just like anytime I have like a stuffy nose or like I'm coughing, like my chest doesn't feel great, my throat doesn't feel great. Like if I have a cold, 
smoking like just feels horrible. It doesn't feel good. Like, I whenever I'm sick, I just want to take cold medicine and sleep. That's it. What's up, Kai? How are you? Fuck studies. Honestly, you're spitting. Did you not hear what I just said, Steel City? Wasn't I said like a week ago? Yeah, I was sick a couple weeks ago, and then spending 10 hours in the cold wasn't great. Also, parasocial much, keeping tabs on my sicknesses. Do ketamine, I'll heal you forever. It's so true. I don't know about that Beckage. Bro, they, it wasn't even a breakfast. It was just like donuts and coffee. I feel like I don't play better when I'm sick, to be honest. No, Shlee, don't say that, please. None of that. The breakfast was just donut. I didn't have it. I just stayed asleep. Coffee and a fat blinker is all you need. You know, I would be inclined to agree with you, agree with you most of the time. No, I paid to watch movies at a drive-in. Why are, why are you forgetting the whole the whole point? It's to watch movies. <laughs> I watched two movies. That's probably worth about 40 bucks normally. Yeah, Shlee paid for the movie. I paid for food. Hello? Why are you forgetting? Why are you not in including the fact that I paid for our food that day? No, me, uh, before the drive in. Before the drive in, we got food. You bought the snacks? Yeah, for yourself. I didn't eat any snacks. <laughs> Would you rather eat? <laughs> it's a really good question, Rue. I don't know if I have an answer. <laughs> it's a really great question. I, I don't, I don't know. Uh, Kez, the movies that played were Terrifier 3, or sorry, it was Smile 2. Terrifier 3, Halloween, The Conjuring, and <laughs> The Thing. Those are the movies that played. Hi, by the way. Yes. We were in the car with the trunk open, chilling, and we had a radio that, like, tuned into the audio. Emmanuel, I don't, I feel like Emmanuel has having a hard time of understanding how drive-ins work. Um, so normally you pay about that amount of money. Normally, ju just to watch movies. So everything else that they added was just extra that like you don't normally get. That's... And we got, that is true. Wait, I didn't, I forgot to mention that. Yeah. We got four free tickets. Headphones would be pretty cool, but I doubt I'd ever do that. Yes. I'm sick because I smoked weed again and not because I was 
up in the freezing cold for 10 hours straight. That makes sense. Yeah, Vekage carries me. Vekage carries me in the same way. Two, three ton anvil. <laughs> Vekage carries me in the same way. Two, three ton anvils chained to my ankles carry me. Yeah, carry me to the bottom of the fucking ocean. Answer Rue's question. Oh, the question, would I rather eat poop or diarrhea? I, diarrhea, because you'd just drink it and it'd be easier, probably, honestly. It'd go down easier. <laughs> it wasn't even that question, the tier list. <laughs> oh, the, what do you prefer to eat? Long ropes, short ropes, or medium length ropes? Oh, that question? <laughs> That's crazy. That's crazy because the last time I played with Vekage, we did good as shit. And we were literally farming. And then I kept playing and I kept getting higher. And then I play with Vekage again and I drop 80 points. So what's up with that? <laughs> what are we talking about now? Pasta? Yeah, sure, yeah. Sure, I guess. Yeah, why not? Have I played with Ruby recently? No, has been a little bit. <laughs> Either way, the drive-in was not the worst experience ever, but it could have been a lot better. If the weather was nicer, if the weather was nicer and the car was more comfortable, like it would have been great. The movies that were being played were movies that I wanted to watch. Uh, it was just unfortunate how cold it was, really. I didn't want a donut. I was already over my calories. So even if I even if I was willing to get one, I wouldn't want it. Paps pasta? Yeah, no thanks. Can we get a poop reveal? Or are you the one just talking about unhinged chats? Yeah, you contribute to it, you robot. Why didn't we go inside the car? We were in the back seat. I mean, I asked like a couple times if we were gonna like turn the heat on or something or like close the trunk for a little bit, but it just kind of got laughed off. So I just suffered, I guess. <laughs> it's really great. <laughs> Is it what it is, I guess. Paps picks. I'm going to start my own gambling platform based on my Rocket League rank. That's actually a good idea. We were outside. We were in the trunk of the car with the trunk open. So like we were in the car, but like not. <laughs> to what room? Excuse me, Cross, what? Sound like a horrible date. 
Bro, have y'all never been to the drive-in before? Like, do you not know how it works? I'm so confused. Bro, like, it was fine. What is this supposed to be? What is this supposed to be? Vecage carrying me? Is that what it's supposed to be? That's fucking crazy. Slee sent that. She just made it. I'm a little bitch. Dude, Slee was freezing and uncomfortable too. Burn to death or freeze to death? Probably like burn to death because or sorry freeze to death because i feel like you would go numb right yeah that wasn't my fucking choice bro if it was my choice i would have been turning the heat on like for like a little bit every hour or something the fuck do you want from me? You're telling me like I'm stupid? Cause that wasn't my fucking choice. You'll carry me? I don't know how that I don't know about that one. I'm not blaming Shlee either. It wasn't her car. Shitty movies? They were movies I wanted to watch. What do you mean? They weren't shitty movies. It's crazy. Is it crazy to ask if your friend's date is hot? Okay. Let's talk about that for a second, because I got stun locked. You know what? Yeah, you're right. You ba you know, you baited me into it again. You baited me. Congrats, it worked. You know what? It worked. You baited me and it worked. This is what you wanted, right? So let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Well, first of all, we didn't bring one blanket, by the way. I brought a blanket and Schlee brought a comforter. And we were still freezing. No, it wasn't my fucking car. It was, it was Ashley's brother's girlfriend's car. And I, I, for some reason, I mean, well, the thing is, they brought, like, sleeping bags and shit. So, like, they were warm and toasty. So, I didn't... I don't think they realized how cold Shalee and I were. What's her name? Why do you all trying to get me to dox her? I don't have a fucking sleeping bag. I didn't even think to bring one. I didn't think it was gonna be fucking freezing! It was like in the 70s during the day. It was, I don't, it was, I don't regret them coming or whatever. It was fine. I mean, it was fun to have a little hangout. It just could have gone better. Like, I, I mean, honestly, it's probably... It's partly my fault, too, because, like, I'm a people pleaser in the way that, like, you know, I didn't want to, like, be annoying and keep mentioning to turn the heat on. Or maybe I said it in a way where they thought I was joking, but, like, I was really fucking cold. I was, like, like, I, my feet and my hands were so cold for, like, hours. It was really not great. But again, it's partly my fault because I did, probably didn't say it in like a serious way or they didn't like understand. So, I mean, if I said, I guarantee if I said like, hey, I'm really, really cold. Can we turn the heat on? They probably would have. But like, I, I don't know. It wasn't my car. It wasn't Schlee's car. It wasn't a situation. And it wasn't something that I was like totally comfortable asking for especially because like i said it in like kind of a joking way i guess 
and I kind of got laughed at. So, Mike Smooch, mwah. Shalee asked you if her brother's GF was hot. Okay, let's be okay. We're being serious for a sec. We're being serious. Yes, the car was the car was literally frosted. I'm not joking. It was like it was in the 30s. I'm not joking. Like literally, it was like in the 30s. I think it's just the, my tone of voice cuz I don't know. It could be your tone too. No, there was there was heat. There was heat. It just wasn't turned on. Okay, let I, I let's get back to the topic at hand, okay? All right. So, the fact that it's like a weird question aside or like kind of like an uncomfortable question to ask. What Okay. If you're asking someone who is like dating someone or in a relationship with someone or whatever like oh is she hot or are they hot like what answer are you expecting like, yeah, she's a little bit disgusting but i put up with it i guess like yeah she's pretty fucking gross it's whatever it's like obviously they find them attractive like like hello that's the, like why would someone ever be in a relationship with someone that they, like, didn't find attractive? Like, <laughs> doesn't make any sense. <laughs> Callus would date a bookshelf? Bitch! Callus got more dates than you! Another case, mwah. Yeah, is the attraction approved? Yeah, I need to know if if they're attractive. I need to know. It's like, bro, it literally just like, it's just so, it makes me uncomfy when, like, again, not only guys, I guess, not only guys, but typically guys, the first thing they do Whenever they talk about, like, women or something, they always have to talk about how attractive they are, or, like, how sexy they think they are, how hot she is. It's like, bro, like, why? Like, please, it's uncomfortable. I don't like it. It's uncomfortable. I don't like it. Stop talking about... Stop, just stop. Have I ever seen a group of women talking about guys even like yeah that's why I told she it's Schley, it's like cishet activities it's uncomfortable sorry it's it's uncomfortable and weird to me I guess You're gonna post a pic at your GF and show off. Considering you're underage, please don't do that. I don't do that in a stop. You came at Ivan with for no re with heat for no reason. Not really. That actually is a good point. I didn't even think about that, Louie. <laughs> you shouldn't even be in the Discord, Steel City. <laughs> I didn't even click in my head. That's crazy. You're still more than welcome to hang out and stream and stuff, but you shouldn't be in Discord. No, my stream's not 18 plus. VKG lol to Churu. Thanks for the prime sub. Discord is there.
Fuck you, Rue. How about that? Hey, thanks for the prime. Just because the Discord is 18 plus doesn't fucking mean that we can fucking post porn, bro. Stop being fucking degenerates. I gave Ivan heat because the second question... Okay, this was Ivan's line of questioning for asking about Callus's uh, date they just had. What's her name? Is she hot? <laughs> That's it. <laughs> like, bro, I, I don't know. In my opinion, fuck you, Rue. A real one ask if she has a sister. I don't know. Bro, like, dude, for example, I was literally talking to my IRL friend not that long ago, like when I reconnected. And he's been in a relationship and stuff for a bit. And I was asking him about his girlfriend. And not a single time did I ask if she was hot. I said, oh, like, what does she do for work? Like, how did you meet her? So on, so forth. That is what I asked him. I didn't go, yo, she fucking hot, dude. You pull pussy, dude. You might eventually, bro. That's not. That's not the point. Is Callus not y'all? Is Callus not your friend? Yeah, not your IRL friend, but, like, they're still your friend. Do they not deserve a level of respect? <laughs> not really, no. Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah, okay. Callus is an enemy. I literally said kill Callus. I don't think the word respect exists in this chat i don't know it's just like some things it's okay to keep to yourself you know that's all i'm trying to say that's all i'm trying to say you know that's just some things to keep to yourself it's, you know it's moral of the story you know Not that hard. Well, not even that. It's not like it's not like asking if someone's hot is like necessarily like mean or something not nice. It's just like why? Like why are you asking that? Like why is that relevant to you? Like obviously I find this person attractive. It's like, why does, why does their attractiveness, like physical attractiveness as a person, like matter to you? I think that's what I'm trying to boil it down to. Why does their physical attractiveness matter to you or have any relevance to you? Like, <laughs> what's, <laughs> would you rather eat? eight pounds of poop or suck 16 dirty and stinky toes that's a that's a good question i'll have to get back to you on that <laughs> is my gf hot no she's fucking disgusting does she have a good personality yeah the point is at least you're getting to know them a little bit 
as a person and not just a fucking meat sack. As a flesh bag. <laughs> Bro. How about, like, what is she into? Is she a gamer? Like, anything. Literally anything beyond surface physical level attraction physical level attraction <laughs> if the like what okay so then why even ask if she thinks she's hot why the fuck does that even matter then to you exactly if nothing matters why even ask does she have huge bazonkers if not cut her off you're below me shut the fuck up Gonna start calling your wife a meat sack from now on. Meat sack, flesh bag, whatever you prefer. I'm trying to picture what she looks like in my head. What size are her boopies? Yeah, actually, I think we need to have a talk is right. Also, why the fuck are you still awake? You have not taken NyQuil and it's midnight now. I hate you. You know what? I hate you. We're over. I decided it. Meat sack with a fat turd cutter. That's crazy. Uber date bit. Hi, Callis. For <laughs> Frida. <laughs> Freedom! Yo, look at that! No, Steel City spitting. How, dude, how is Steel City 17 years old yet has more decorum than some of you degenerate motherfuckers? Emmanuel really hung hung on the fact Papsy Poo. Women are born to sex, clean, and die. Period. You respect women. Period. Steel City is not Anu. Anu himself was literally in stream like a couple days ago. You understand that, right? Holy shit, it's Cooter. Holy shit, it's Coder. Oh, yeah. Your... The convert... Your, your situation was just a vector, Callus. We weren't really talking about that. Best line to come into? Wait, what line? Was he not banned? Remember I unbanned everyone? That one time? There's only, like... There's probably only a handful of people banned from my channel right now. Not many people. Have you smelled horse shit? I mean, probably. Yeah, I've been to like a farm. Wait, that's your spitting double moose. Anu followed me and I was in a menu's unit. Paps the Rocket League card. The Pepsi poof followed by seven love emojis. Being in junior high? Wait, what? Where was the junior high comment? Cooter. I can't I can't see like say the word that word without saying it in a southern accent because of Mar. Wait, what's not funny, Callus? Slee, what you, what's the first thing you're gonna do now that you're free? Bye, Louie. Thanks for lurking. Lock in. 
I swear I could have been the dad, but I made that bitch abort it. Oh, I didn't hear. <laughs> okay. Additions was elite, though. Additions was an elite bar. Fuck the first person over 18 I see. Wow. They're really flying off the handle, huh? <laughs> Would you say... <laughs> That's a crazy question, Gim. Would you stop world hunger by eating your eating your own weight in diarrhea? <laughs> like, bro, I don't know if AI could could recreate some of this. That's crazy. Would I? Um, to stop world hunger? Yeah, I mean, yeah, I guess so. It'd be tough though. Solve world hunger or buy Twitter? Who, who am I? Elon Monk? You're gonna ask your mom that tomorrow? I feel bad for the people living in your house. Just oh wait, that's actually that's actually so true. I'm gonna give myself COVID, that way I can't taste, and then boom. I'm 30 pounds. I actually weighed myself yesterday. I'm 118 pounds. Actually. I can see that, Shlee. You might have not animate on. Would you rather have sex with a family member or one billion dollars? A, a billion dollars? I feel like... I don't know. Uh, my official stats right now are I am I'm five three, 118 pounds, all muscle. I don't know if my family member is gay as fuck, then I'm a half to tap. Hold on. What? 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 Hold on. That's what, dude, Kawas, that's what I'm saying. I was defending you. I said, at least they've been on more dates. I had your back, bestie. You said hot and your phone corrected to gay. Either way, I don't think that... I don't think that... That doesn't change change it at all actually it maybe makes it worse would you rather kiss men or women that's a good question why not bullet you said it as a joke no i know i'm just messing around actually callus this is a good what matters most of all is like do you get uncomfortable when people ask you that question? Or do you think it's uncomfortable to ask people that question? I, I guess that's really what matters the most, right? Like, in this personal case.
Only trash TV one of the go to the game. Doesn't matter what Callus wants, what the hell? I mean, I, yeah, I can see what you're going for, Emmanuel. But I guess Callus doesn't enjoy it. I see what you're going for, but the the subject is not enjoying it. Oh, okay. So Callus does agree with me. Thank you. I mean, yeah, I guess. I guess I'm not the best at realizing people are trying to joke, maybe. It just didn't seem like a joke, but. a Paisy. Did I eat today? I did. Now I'm having a zero sugar starry. What do you think about that? Why do I beat Levi? Wait, what? What the fuck are you talking about? Did I remember you? That was your first chat ever. I mean, maybe. I mean, potentially Callus. I don't know. Levi loves me. What are you talking about? That's still weird. That's so uncomfortable. Oh, I don't know. I don't like that. That didn't help Vekage. I mean, yeah, obviously. But there's plenty of stuff people say online. They don't say IRL. It's not really the point. A lot of people value physical attractiveness, their, their perceived physical attractiveness, first and foremost, and it's uncomfortable and I don't like it. Is my GF hot? I'm not dating anyone. Shli and I broke up because she didn't have NyQuil and it's midnight and she's still awake. Even though I told her to take NyQuil an hour and a half ago and she said she would in 20, 30 minutes when she tries to go back to sleep. And then 20, 30 minutes later, she was on Discord posting taxidermy pictures, even though she's like getting sick and tired and said she needed sleep. She's not going to sleep. She didn't take NyQuil. And then she's still in stream chat right now. <laughs> oh, sorry. Sorry about that. My, my bad. I don't know, Rue. Are you? People can make their own choices. Interesting. So when it when it comes to me choosing to sleep in or something, then I'm a piece of shit. And how the fuck does she do it? How does she do it? The blood pressure. But when she does the same shit, when she does the same shit. It's people can make their own choices. Stop it. 
What's up with that? What's up with all that? You played with Miklandi yesterday? That's my fucking goat. That is my fucking goat. Did you put some respect on his name? Oh, okay. My teammate had full boost and did that, huh? That's tough. Callus, that could have mended the relationship right there. You had the chance in the op. What happened to your fast typing speed? Literally one of the one of the times in your life where your fast ass typing speed would come in handy and you trolled it. Vekage, there has got to be a reason and a solution beyond what you're doing right now. Like, nothing fundamentally changed about your PC. Unless you, like, downloaded something or whatever. Like, bro, my PC that I used to have, specs-wise, was 100% worse than the PC you have now, for sure. And I never had an issue like this, that, uh, and I couldn't fix it and still, like, play on full screen and stuff. I would just turn Rocket League to... High priority, I would have other settings optimized. Spin. My teammate driving across the field to try to challenge, that's crazy. Wait, really, Kez? I figured that shit out a long time ago. But I also, I can't lie though, I was also surprised when I figured it out, so. Wow, bro. Don't type to players who have fun in your rank. That's so cringe. Oh my god. <laughs> Why can't Rocket League players be normal, bro? So weird, bro. Oh, no, man. I know it's not just Rocket League, but oh, my God, bro. Some people are so weird. Why are people like this?
Like, like on a serious note, how does someone type some shit like that and not be like embarrassed? Embarrassing. First game on, by the way. <laughs> First game on, it's gonna be one of those nights, huh? The song has so much history. That was interesting. Such an intense first game. So much on the line. We lost. Yeah, that was like the worst possible thing my teammate could have done. Like literally like of all the plays they could have done, they did the worst one, so. Unlucky. Can't you like reset your windows or whatever? Vekage? I've never seen Ferris Bueller, but it's a classic I gotta watch. Amanda, your PC is close to end of life. GG, little man. It's so cringe. Like, there's no way that that's not like a 15 year old saying that shit. If not, that's so. Like, if that's like an adult saying that, that'd be really bad. Cows, what are you talking about? I've been talking with Vekage about this across multiple streams. Oh my god, Kez, you gotta back those songs up. Too many important files? Do you know how to like back up files and stuff? It's not like if your PC still works, you can easily just back up the files, then re-download them. An OT that I lost. Let's go. What a start to the game. <laughs> I love scoring a nice pinch like that. Feels good. I have a 4070 Ti. Well, I mean, I haven't... I haven't bought a PC for, like, a y almost a year and a half now. So, obviously, I'm not really going to be the most up-to-date. But when I bought my PC last last summer, uh, 4070 Ti was really good value to performance. 
I don't know if that is still true today and how it still performs compared to other stuff, but yeah, the, the 4070 Ti was a, a really good uh, price to performance ratio. PCs literally half in price, it's so bad. Yeah, I mean, as PCs definitely lose value. Technology in general, I feel like, loses value relatively quickly compared to how expensive it was. What is happening, bro? Maybe I just gotta play twos. This rank, like, just, like, I feel like I get too annoyed at my teammates when I play on stream. And it's like a, not a good spiral. Two forty hertz, hertz monitor or nothing. That's what I'm that's what I say. Do they have three sixties that are affordable yet or what? They got like five hundred hertz monitors or some shit. When I was looking for, like, when I was buying this PC, 240 was, like, the highest I was willing to go price-wise. Just because, like, I wanted 1440p, 240 hertz, and it was not horrible price-wise. But 360 hertz, once you get higher than that, it was like really expensive I would have been not happy if that was a goal well there's no point going over 240 especially for how expensive it is like, if it was affordable, yeah, but this is not. I play video games for a living. I mean, yeah, true. I, I, I wanted to... I, I made sure when I got this PC, I wanted it to be, like, future-proof. Oh, wait, yo! Years. Lando, we were just talking about you. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. First and foremost, thank you for the raid. I appreciate you. As always, you're freaking awesome. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I hope you had a good stream. Thank you for spreading the love. But more importantly, Callus has something to say to you. It's very important. They tried to tell you in a rank game earlier, but you left too quick. They have something to tell you. They have something to tell you. I feel like I'm a parent, like, standing next to my child right now. Go on. Tell him. Tell him what you want to say. It was not GG's. Oh, yeah. The one-sided beef is over. Yay! <laughs> Yahoo! <laughs> it's one-sided beef. That's awesome. I love it.
<laughs> On a serious note, though, Lando, thank you for the raid. I, you don't got to stay. You don't got to uh, fucking stay for longer than you want to, but you do have to tell me one thing. Just tell me MMR gain or loss. That's all I want to know. It was three years ago? Damn, dude. I've been, I have known some people for so long. Like, that chat was three years ago, which means... I've probably, like, been acquainted with Mick, with Lando for, like, five years or some shit, bro. That's so crazy. You played TCG? Oh, you're a dork. What are you, like, Pokemon or something, you dork? Just kidding. I like Pokemon, too. I'll be honest. I like Pokemon. I just don't, I don't really like the trading card game. I like Pokemon, but I'm not really a big fan of the card game. <laughs> Pokemon are cool. Stop it. Bro, I already said I'm probably never going to try to hardcore Nuzlocke Renegade Platinum again. Like, on stream, at least. It's, it's just not worth the amount of time I put into it for what I get out. Like, just constantly wasting like 50 hour runs i'd rather i'd if i'm ever gonna do it i would much rather do it on my own time no i know i know i've seen i've seen charlie play it it's where you like literally have your own shop right I can't, I literally, if I do play Renegade Platinum again, it'll be on my own time for fun. Wait, off brand? I thought it was like legit. When I saw Critical playing it, it was like legit. So give your dogs pets and loves. Hello? Did I lose my last run? Yeah, I, I would be starting on a fresh run. Oh, is that what I was seeing? It looked legit. Did someone request this? I think so. Old Maroon 5 slapped low-key. Hey, it's okay. Your dog deserves all the love in the world. The last... I lost to, um... Was it a... Like, actually, my teammate just centered it for them, but it's fine. Um, I lost... I lost my run to a team... Uh, team Galactic admin. I just, I didn't prepare for the battle like I should have. I was like rushing it and I lost. It is sad. I'll eventually start up a Renegade Platinum 
run like like I said, I'm on my own. On my own time for fun. I'll probably enjoy it more if I'm doing for fun and I'll have like less like I think a big part of when I play Pokemon and stuff like that I like am trying to rush 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 because I don't want it to be like boring content of me like doing inconsequential shit on stream. But if I'm playing it on my own time and stuff, I, I don't really have those stresses and pressure and I can like take all the time in the world to do whatever I want and just kind of enjoy it more. That, no, I made it much further than that, Vekage. Why is this dork just quick chat spamming? Some people gotta pick up a new hobby, bro. Your GF won't let you smoke? Dude, on a serious note, if you're, if you are, especially under the age of 18, you like, shouldn't, like, at all. You shouldn't be drinking alcohol, smoking weed, cigarettes, anything. Especially if you're under the age of 18. It like, I'm not even just saying this to be like, A, a cringe ass adult. Like, there are actual medical concerns and medical studies showing that alcohol, cannabis, all those things like impact your, your brain growth. And that's not good. And then cigarettes are just horrible for you. Yeah, if I got a better doink, there's a goal. That would be a crazy ultimatum for someone to put on their partner, I can't lie. <sighs> Cigarettes are unhealthy, eats 10 Big Macs. Yeah, right. Joke's on you, I don't go to McDonald's. Fuck that gross shit. Didn't McDonald's just recently have like an E. coli outbreak for like the quarter pounder or something? That's awesome. That means no, Vekage got the answer. I don't even know what this radio is. If someone gave you an ultimatum like that, then yeah, you shouldn't be in a relationship with them. Bro, I... This is Boo Man Radio. Are these like backed up requests or something? Coming.
These are all song requests. Is it like a backlog or something? It's all good. I'll fix it. Troublemaker. I think this is the accurate request. What doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Get McDonald's. So you gotta. That's that's part of the of human life. You need to be beating the fuck out of your body, just constantly. Just do things that like almost kill you, and you get Zenkai boost like a fucking Saiyan in Dragon Ball. Just bring yourself to the brink of death over and over again. You'll get so powerful. If the cues go like those threes games. Under for sure. My <laughs> That's how you wake up. That's how you go to sleep and wake up. You get punched with a Mike Tyson punch. Broly boosts? What? I don't know. I'm not feeling... Super confident with how I'm playing either. We'll see. Knowing me, it could be one of those days where I play bad and win when I shouldn't be. Oh, well, I'd rather I'd rather I'd rather play bad and win than Actually, I don't know. I don't know if I'd rather play bad and win than play good and keep losing. I guess it's better to win, right? I feel like playing I feel like playing good and losing constantly though is really frustrating. Not even close, to be honest. I guess playing, playing good, playing bad and winning though feels so unrewarding. Like I'm not even like happy about it. I'm like, I'm playing like fucking shit. I don't even deserve this. Peak. Playing bad, it is funny, I guess. <laughs> Hold on. Your skin is unpierceable? Hold on, what? What if Transformers Megan Fox asks you to quit weed? Bro, I think it's pretty, pretty simply put. Like, sobriety is, like, an individual's choice. It's not really, like... That's not really, some like, an ultimatum that someone can, like, put on someone else and expect it to be effective in any way. Like, that's a choice that needs to come from within. And, like... As someone who does enjoy cannabis, I have no problem taking breaks and stuff for my health, which I do regularly. But, like, if someone gave me the ultimatum that, like, I can never smoke weed again, then we're just obviously not compatible, and that's okay.
If someone said like, "Can you please not smoke weed around me or something?" That's that's all like different. I would have no problem doing that. Tier 3 sub if I hit SSL today. That would be a crazy grind. I would need to go plus 150. You know what? I'll do it. You don't drink water. That shit kills people. Dude, Loki. Everyone who's ever drank water has died. Have you ever thought about that sometimes? No, I could have touched that so much better. My teammate might have been able to score. Oh, okay. You want it more, I guess. I was playing around and got and someone in the chat goes, please beat this Vekic guy. I have a clip of my buddy Malar beating him and he was malding. Wait, what? Who? Pretty please with big eyes. Oh, if you do that, then it's okay. Can you please not smoke around me? No, fuck you. Everyone but you. Watch the vid in general after this game. Sure. I got you. Hi, Brayden. Did Malar clown on you, bro? Did Malar walk you like a dog? I, ke I keep thinking of Malamar. Malamar is a pretty cool mon. Psychic Dark is a cool typing. Oh. No. The invisible hackers in Rocket League, fortunately, haven't been around for a while. I was lucky enough to never play. I don't think I ever played any invisible cheaters in Rocket League, but I did play, unfortunately, multiple DDoSers. That sucked. I never played any invisible people, though. But getting DDoS was just as bad. If not worse, at least you had a chance to beat the invisible person, right? DDoSing, you just you don't even have an, a, an opportunity. It's gonna be good. We got pressure. Hmm. I think my teammate is trying to pass that. I see the vision, I guess. Nice. I feel like I'm playing. Damn, I feel like my teammate and I played really good off each other that game. I was like always looking for like a pass like that to him. Good job. Good job, Turtle Jr. Well played. Pikachu. Music, tier one. Just subscribed for 34 months. Okay, this is cool and all, but you know what the people I really didn't check back in. Sorry. You flip. DDoSing has fallen off. I haven't, I haven't gold and wanted to quit the game completely. Yeah, they fixed it, I'm pretty sure. They're doing you a favor? What the fuck you mean they're doing me a favor? Hi, music. Thank you. I've given you flips before. I'm sick. If I wasn't sick, maybe I would. I'm not feeling it. Thank you for the sub. I uh, Okay, on a serious note, I can't believe it's been 34 months. Holy shit, dude.
That's so crazy. Thank you again for the sub. And I that's actually so much longer than I would have expected. Jesus Christ. Bro, that's, that's not exactly the day, bro. Yeah, literally yesterday, this guy. Was like, bro, that's, that's not exactly the day, bro. Yeah, literally yesterday, this guy. Was like, what would you do if this guy's your your attorney? And he goes, you wanna, wait, 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 I can tell you right now, my my client is innocent, and here are the, here are the reasons. And it's just, it's just all, it's just literally, just, where were you on uh, Wednesday? That's at, so uh, rude. <laughs> <It's just, laughs> you wanna, it's impossible for my clients to be guilty, considering the fact that he literally was playing Fortnite. <laughs> uh, He's got an alibi with his, with his homies. Dude, that's so... Wait, he went for that. <laughs> that's valid. Yeah. yeah. That is so brutal. Oh my god. I can feel the awkwardness, bro. That is so brutal. Oh, oh man. That's... That's tough. It really is. It's okay. Yeah, I've been sick. I've I've only been sick for like I started getting sick on like Sunday, but it's okay. I think if he asked if his mic was muted, I feel like that would have made it like so much worse. I don't know. Emmanuel permanently lives in like 2015 mentally. I like my cheese drippy, bruh. What's up, Fragger? What's up, Luke? How are you doing? I just went live on YouTube. I kind of forgot to go live, but I'm live now. I just realized I won that game. Nice. Emmanuel requested this song. Wait, why? Emmanuel, why that date? Kez, are you tapped into every single game that is involved with penis and farts and cocks and stuff? Oh. I guess I, I kind of forget that the World Cup got like... Like the whole World Cup chain... Like... Was that the first time the World Cup was ever played during a winter? In its entire history? Kez is... Kez, you're such an interesting little critter. I forgot the World Cup got bought with like blood money and stadiums were built with like slave labor and shit to have it be played in the winter. That was kind of crazy. That World Cup was the best because my goat won. It's okay, Luke. You still were first. What's up, Demarcus? How are you? And Blue Lock was airing. Wait, Blue Lock was airing during the World Cup time? Really? That's kind of sick. Bro. 
That is example number 58, why you don't go for corner boost on 2v2 kickoff. Unless you specifically call for it, that you're going there. Nice. I'm doing alright. Just playing some Rocket League. How you doing? I'm a little bit sick. It's not great. They trolled that opportunity so hard. What the hell? <laughs> what is this song, bro? Well, dude, no. Going for boost... Going for boost on kickoff isn't necessarily like... Wait, did I somehow miss that corner? What the hell? Going for boost on kickoff isn't necessarily bad if you call it. Like, if you let me know you're going for boost, then it makes me do... The, like, I'll do the kickoff differently. I'll try to get the ball to you or, like, not stall it or something. But if you, like, go for that corner boost and say nothing... You're just asking to get scored on. Like exactly what happened. He went for boost. I didn't know. The kickoff stalled. And then he just got beat to the ball. And they scored an open net. But like, like I said, if you tell me you're going for the corner boost, it's fine. This is, a, this is a really bad habit in 2v2. Getting some good... Oh. Uh, hold on, don't mind me. I messed up my wave dash and things were starting to uh, get worse. <laughs> I just fig both of them so hard. Hmm. NLE Choppa is definitely one of the uh, Coolest rappers, in my opinion. He's so ass. Now he has some good songs. Okay. What's up, Frosty? How you doing? And only Choppa is gay. It's just, I don't know why my teammate touched that. I'm going to be annoyed. He's so lucky I saved that. Jesus Christ. That would have been fucking abysmal. He lost anyways, so. Wait. Oh my god, they trolled another chance. That's crazy. His blue team has trolled like two chances they definitely could have scored. It's fine. Mm. Mm. It's all good. We win this. Mm. 
Bang! That's a slot. Holy slaughter. Slaughter. New Kanye album coming soon. Kanye West threatens to release new music. Did you make up NLE Choppa being gay? I'm pretty sure he's not. Oh. He is really inclusive. I have seen some stuff where he was like performing at like a drag bar or something and he's like had a positive inclusive LGBTQ plus message. So that's a W. That's what I was thinking of. You liked and subscribed? Hey, W, thank you. Uh, basketball just started back up, right? I live in Massachusetts, so I'm unfortunately a Celtics fan. But thank you, Sans. I appreciate it. Yeah, that's what I was thinking of. That's why I, that's why I think NLE Chop is a W. Do I like to sing? No, I have no. I have no singing talent. Your fifth favorite team? What's your favorite? What's up? Fart Inhaler Slam Poetry. Love to see ya. Oh my god, Nexif? What the fuck? What the hell? Dude, I swear to god, I was talking about you, like, not even that long ago. Like, maybe like a couple months ago, max. Holy shit. What the hell? That's so weird. How the how the fuck are you? What are you up to nowadays? That's so crazy. You don't got to give me a full deep dive into your life, but what are you up to nowadays? That's a goal. Wait, what do you mean, Steel City? What's up, Cozy? Am I anywhere? This is GC3 right now. This is uh, 1740, I think. Damn, I'm actually sad. I haven't seen any of your stuff. I haven't seen any of the short form content. What the hell? What do you make content for now? Still Fortnite? Go back to Rocket League? That's so cool. I like it's so cool. I don't know. Like I literally was not talking about you that long ago. And it's so interesting that you just popped up. Just Fortnite? It's still cool. That's so cool. Bro, okay. Do you want to hear, like, a random-ass memory that I have? I literally have a random-ass memory of me doing one of those, like, YouTube IRL streams I used to Oh, come on. That's such a silly goal. Um, but I have a... I used to do, like, IRL streams on YouTube when I would go to, like, uh my college friends like dorm or or not a dorm it's like an apartment uh and i was doing one of those irl streams drunk as shit but i remember dude i remember that like you were in i fucking wish i remember what we were talking about but i specifically remember talking to you like you're one of the people in my chat <laughs> i was drunk as shit sitting on my friend's couch like 
Oh, God, I think it was something about, like, I should do, like, like a trick off the stairs or something. Fuck, I wish I remember. But I have such a random memory of exactly that. Just being drunk and you being one of the people talking to me in the YouTube live stream chat. Dude, I used to do live streams, like, towards the end of parties. Like, I would do, I would still stream, like, Rocket League and stuff. But I would do live streams at, like, the end of parties and, like, just walk around. Oh, you definitely were trying to get me to do something stupid. For sure. You look here, remember that? Honestly, you might have been there, too, because it was, like... That was, like, one of the last times I went to campus, I'm pretty sure, to, like, party. Hold on, YouTube chat. I'm not ignoring you, but... It's hard to read both chats and play at the same time, but this game's looking not great anyways. Patriots jersey? Okay, that's a lie. That's a made-up memory. I don't think I ever did that. I even played Rocket League in a solid year. Bro, do you remember wagering crimson voltaics with me do you regret that did you get really did you get angry this it was like years ago i feel like you were actually angry and i kind of felt bad when it happened what's up hasbulla no you weren't there frosty I, this i'm talking like 2018 type shit uh i'm good fear what's up cozy what's up baseball boy hi tay I used to play rock band. Oh yeah, don't forget y'all. If you're in the YouTube stream, don't forget to drop a like on the live stream. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Both of those things help me out a lot. And we are we are on the road to 25,000 subscribers. God, I have... I have so many random memories involving you i remember making like a short like youtube video like when you subscribe to my youtube channel that was that was pretty cringe but i think i like scored a good goal like or i what i thought was a good goal at the time like and you subscribed to me like at the same time and the title was like next if subscribing to me I'll, makes me score a good goal question mark <laughs> Something stupid like that. I wish I... Bro, I don't even know. That's funny. I used to love Rock Band. Like, actually... Oh, I'm on going. Yeah. I just have... I have, like, random-ass memories stored in my brain. From... Stuff from years ago. Hey, no, no worries. Hey, I appreciate you popping in and hanging out for a little bit and saying hi. It was really nice to reminisce for a second there. I'm glad you've been well and I'm glad you're still uh, doing content and stuff. Don't be, don't be afraid to say hi again. Always nice to hear from you. What is this? Ask Gim. Oh my god, I'm the beast. <laughs> Let's go, and my teammate kept it up at zero seconds. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> hey, see you around, Nectip, see you around. Oh, please tell me. Dude. Salty. What's up, Mins? What's up, Mr. Cat? What's up, Gaming Fanatic? How are you? What's up, Azori Wolf? How are you? I always I remember playing rock bands with my uh, rock band, my friends. 
I think I got I got good enough to be decent at the guitar, unlike the hardest difficulty, but only on some songs. What's up, Artero? How are you? What's up, Nick A30? Damn, that's that's cold. Them kindergartners are tough. I never played Guitar Hero. I never had it. I think I had Rock Band 1. I had Rock Band 1 and 2, I think. That's it. I can't play. Yeah, I can't play. Oh, this guy loves AI art, too. Oh, God. I gotta change my name, bro. I can't have anyone who likes AI art talking to me. <laughs> I gotta change that, bro. That's unacceptable. I mean, Rock Band and Guitar Hero were essentially the same thing. Except... Uh, Rock Band just had more instruments. Did Guitar Hero ever get other instruments? Or was that just Rock Band? Playing the drums on Rock Band was pretty fun. Guitar Hero Warriors of Rock, best Guitar Hero. Your B-Day is soon, hey. If you come in and tell me when it's your birthday, I'll tell you happy birthday. You were, s oh, Tay, that's so sad. You were someone's Vegeta? Oh, that's actually so sad. That's an interesting memory, Frosty. It was in kindergarten. You were making out with people and getting hickeys in kindergarten? What? I okay, nah, that might be too cringe. I can't lie. That might be too cringe. You know what? Being Vegeta is still pretty good, right? Being Vegeta I means you're still pretty, pretty strong, pretty good. So you know what? You're still other. You're still some people's favorites. Who's my fave? Vegeta is my favorite. Vegeta just has like... Dude, fuck off. Vegeta has hands down. Uh, the best like character arc in, in Dragon Ball. Oh, Fugu, did you finish Super yet? I pray that this guy's name isn't the IDF that I'm thinking of. Nice shot. Jesus loves you. God loves you. Satan loves you. Satan loves you so much and wants to take you to hell. Repost this message 10 times or Satan's going to appear in your room tonight. Ooh, five more episodes. Super, the last episodes of Super are like the best. The animation is crazy. The fights are crazy. 
That shit's so good. Share in five seconds or this demon will haunt your dreams tonight. <laughs> Bro, on the anime website I use, I saw someone copy and pasting one of those chains. And at the end, he's like, sorry, guys, can't chance it. I can't risk it being true, guys. <laughs> Probably like an actual, like, fucking eight-year-old. Feels bad. Should be fine. Oh my god. Wait, score that. Oh my god, my goat. Do I have white octane? Yes. What's good, Trey? I'm losing viewers with that one. No! No! <laughs> no! No, not my not my staunch evangelical Christian viewers. No! I I can't believe it. What's up, Gabby? That's so funny. <laughs> no, how dare you say that? Yeah, if you're gonna talk badly of if you're going to tell me Satan's going to come to my room, I'm unsubscribing. I like dark humor, but that's a little bit too far. Peak. That's weird, Geoids. Don't say that. Hi, though. I'm throwing. Oh, my God. I'm throwing. Okay. Wait, actually, I'm peeking. I'm nervous. No, just don't say that. <laughs> I can see those emotes, by the way, Callus. It's, it's on your end, but I'm assuming. I'm cooked. Oh my god, my teammate is peeking. Uh oh. No. Wait. That's actually good. Spawn here. I don't think I would have scored that anyways. Good force for my teammate. Oh, I'm tough, man. Uh... I really gotta get on my critiquing every time Vekic gets scored on grinds. I keep forgetting to do it. So I'm not a fucking piece of shit, but I gotta make it a point. I 
I'm not buying any Spider-Man stuff. Bro, why are you giving this shitty ass fucking company any money? Like, genuinely. Sub Colin. Buy the rocket pass. Buy items that I want. But I'm never gonna be fucking putting money into this fucking game. Like I've had these credits I've all got for, for free. This is not money I put into the game. I don't give a fuck about Spider-Man. I don't give a fuck about superhero stuff. I'm not giving Epic Games a fucking cent. The only credits anyone should spend are credits that people already had. If the game brings you joy and satisfaction, why not invest in the company? Dude, you're speaking like you're a fucking uh, stockholder. <laughs> Bro thinks he has stock in Epic Games buying stuff off the item shop. Bond. It's good. Thanks for the follow on Twitch. I appreciate that. Oh. Close. Oh, that's bad. One v one. Oh, okay, nice. Sixteen hundred is the worst rank in the game. Definitely one of the most frustrating. That's for sure. I remember when the Rocket League community was like together for like two days and people were like that's it i'm boycotting the item shop fuck epic games they took away trading and they just want more money and then literally people like bought the lightning mcqueen bundle not even a week later and they were like dude lightning mcqueen is literally my childhood i have to buy it and you know damn well the motherfuckers saying that shit have used lightning mcqueen like five times that's the best part Like, bro, you're not going to use this car after, like, a week. And you'll keep playing Rocket League. Motherfuckers lost their resolve over, over Lightning McQueen. Shit is crazy.
All right. My teammate might be able to get back to the. Oh, they were getting beat up. That hurts, man. Uh, that's exactly what I did, but you stopped playing the game. I guess that's better than nothing. The Frogan stuff is wild. Elaborate. I think I know what you mean, but... Is that in? Ethan, Ethan Klein was running like a, a a witch hunt on some Arab content creators. Thanks for the sub, Jordan. Do I have a settings video? What settings are you looking for? <sighs> Bro, that Drew Pavlu guy's a fucking freak. Am I? I am I allowed to show this? On stream? I don't know if I can. You and your girl broke up after two years? Damn. I'm sorry to hear that, but things will get better. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the stream, y'all, by the way. I don't even do. I feel like I don't want to watch this on stream. It's gonna like. I have no pity at all for any fucking soldiers. Distress, thank you so much. I will never have any fucking pity for any fucking soldiers. U.S. military, who fucking who? I hope you get PTSD. You know? I I hate this Drew Pablo guy I do, so the much. The ones I do, I the ones I'm like whatever about the U.S. soldiers are the ones that like acknowledge that like what they did was wrong. They didn't know well back. They didn't know back then. Whatever. You're you're a good person in my book. I'm like a Tom. Thank you so much for the ten gifted. <laughs> the, the the U.S. military that are like yeah like. You Ethan know, Klein's I did a fucking back then, freak, but now dude. I know it's wrong. Like I'm changed. Like fuck imperialism. Fuck this. You don't deserve this PTSD. But like any other motherfucker, you're joining them. You're like, oh my god, I want my fucking Camaro. No student loans. Fuck you. I hope you get PTSD. And I hope you get no health insurance when you get back into the fucking America. Uh. <clears throat> I probably can't say what I want to say. <laughs> uh. 
We'll just say Christino's pretty close. Uh, don't forget if you're in the YouTube stream to drop a sub and like. I appreciate both those things. All right. <laughs> Thanks for the follow, Mac. Preach, preach. What's up, yeah, uh, Yak Nasty? How are you? I think Ethan Klein is a freak ass racist Zionist who has been descending further and further into grifting as a conservator. Conservator? Conservative? I, I keep trying to change my fucking name. Okay, Kez. Let's, let's like, you know, talk this through the steps. Why are those soldiers getting PTSD? Exactly. I'm doing all right, Wilkes. How you doing? Bro, they were doing, like, an interview with some IDF soldier hey, who literally said that he had PTSD and couldn't eat meat anymore because he was one of the, one of the people that operated bulldozers that ran over people alive and dead. And he said it was so gruesome. The sight was so gruesome that he can't eat meat anymore. That motherfucker murdered so many people. Are we like supposed to feel bad? Like genuinely. That is what she's talking about, by the way. What's up, Crimson? Like, why are we running puff pieces for people that have done that? Like, am I supposed to feel bad? Like... I have seen IDF soldiers, seen so many videos of them doing the most disgusting things. Them like playing music and dancing and singing as they like bomb civilians and like blow up houses. People who have bulldozers and they're just running over like tents and encampments and stuff. Like, am I supposed to feel bad for these people if they get like PTSD? Like they're do like they're getting PTSD because they're doing evil fucking shit. That's why they're getting PTSD. They're they're doing evil fucking shit to human beings. Of course they're getting PTSD. They're being they're fucking being villains. Like, oh, after I after I murdered a hundred people by running them over with a bulldozer, I got PTSD. Like, okay. Fucking and? Should you feel bad for Hitler for killing himself? Or I've had this discussion with people before, and I genuinely had some motherfucker saying that like yeah even though it's hitler like you shouldn't be happy that he died because a human life was lost and i literally cannot fucking fathom how someone's brain like that works who said that emmanuel no those people are evil well that because that's what's that's what spawns 
the whole topic. You understand that, right? There was like a puff piece on like CNN or M MSNBC and they brought on an IDF soldier talking about his his PTSD and his trauma and he that's what he did. He was a bulldozer operator that ran over civilians in Gaza, Palestinians, alive and dead. Again, it was so gruesome. It was so gruesome that he said he can't eat meat anymore because it gives him trauma and PTSD. That is how disgusting and gruesome. Imagine... Oh, God. I'm going to start popping off. The, this motherfucker is literally a murderer of who knows how many people. But enough people to the point where he can no longer eat meat because he fucking pulverized so many bodies. Why the fuck would I ever, 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 ever have any sympathy and feel bad for someone who develops PTSD after that? Genuinely. You do not need to be Palestinian to want a free Palestine. Well, Kez, you realize that that is exactly why that clip was was made, right? Like, that clip was made to exactly farm the kind of reaction from people like you. Your people? Are you Palestinian? Oh, damn. That's kind of insane that you came in right when we're talking about that topic. Yeah, exactly. What Vekage and Callus are saying. Kez. Like, that motherfucker Drew Pavlu, whatever the fuck, he is a disgusting little freak. He's a disgusting, genocidal little freak. And... He intentionally made that clip and framed it in the way he did because he's a disgusting little freak. Guy's upset, I guess. If I speak, if I say what I think about the military industrial complex. I'm going to get stun locked into a long conversation. They're not evil. They sign documents and fo Okay, if you blindly follow if you blindly follow evil instructions, does that not make you evil? It makes you evil and ignorant. You can't hide behind a veil of ignorance. If your superior officer in the military said, yeah, I need you to fucking run over these people with a bulldozer. And you did it. You can't be like, oh, sorry, I'm just ignorant. I'm just following orders.
like, Chris, you're acting like this is like fucking Call of Duty, bro. Like, we're talking about like real fucking human lives. You understand that, right? It absolutely is the U.S. government's fault. Our engineers in Lockheed Martin Evil. Uh, yeah, I would say the ones that are developing like the baby shredding machines. Yeah, they're pretty evil. Like the weapons manufacturers and shit. Yeah, they're pretty fucking evil people. That's a pretty easy question to answer. There was a clip I saw recently of a guy who went to one of those like expos where like all like the weapon weapons manufacturers and engineers meet up and he's like going up to the people like hey can you point me to the ne to the baby shredding machine can you uh let me know who created the machine that just blows up babies blows up innocent people let me know that guy was base as hell Mint chocolate chip. I fuck with Mr. Munchkin, man. We shouldn't be the Middle East at all. Yeah, period, obviously. Selling your soul for pay still makes you a bad person. Sorry. Selling your soul for pay when you know that what you're doing is contributing to people literally fucking dying. Innocent people dying partly because of your actions. Yeah, you're still a bad person. Your soul isn't yours to sell. I don't know what that means. I've lost like four in a row or something. I need to walk in. Not that it matters in the womb or born babies. Both. Doesn't matter. The bombs that are raining in Gaza and Palestine, they're killing women. They're killing children they're killing men they're killing pregnant women they're killing every single person on the ground they are ki indiscriminately if you are in gaza you're getting murdered doesn't matter who you are And it's funded by us. Oh, never mind. Oh, okay. Yeah, free Palestine. For real, for real.
Who's choosing to fund it? Yeah, our evil ass government. Oh, I yeah, no, I've se I've seen that figure. Hey, I I appreciate I appreciate the sub. Thank you. If you're on YouTube, don't forget to like and subscribe. Appreciate both those things. I'm pretty sure I've saw was did Hassan watch that? I swear I've seen that. What's my opinion on abortion? <laughs> I think people should have the freedom to choose what they want to do with their bodies. But I think bodily autonomy is really important. Eminem at the Obama rally. Fuck Eminem. They're trying to prop him up. The same guy who, like, not even a couple of months ago is making music about how he wants to call everything gay and the world's too soft now. They're propping him up at fucking Obama rallies. Have I heard of the Rwandan genocide? Yes. Do I like Uzi? Yeah, their music's pretty good. don't really think they're a good person though. Holy fuck, I actually just couldn't reach that. The world is too soft, okay. I feel like if you're someone that unironically says like the world's too soft or something, you're just actually a dork. Rick and Morty bar. What the fuck? You gonna cancel me, bruh? You gonna Gen Z me, bruh? You're too soft. Don't Gen Z me, bruh. That's like actually the corniest shit. Point proven? Bro, are you are you a fifty year old like Gen Xer or something? I thought we didn't claim that. But. Point proven, you're too soft. <laughs> Shut up, bro. <laughs> Great. Bro's in a Rocket League live stream talking about how the world's too soft now. Okay. Uh, near zero would be the answer. Cal.
The world is too soft. The world is too soft is usually code word for like, I want to say slurs and have no consequences. That's usually what that means. Gen Z is lazy. They don't like to work. Pe dude, the people saying Gen Z is lazy and shit are like, they bought like a house for like fucking a nickel and two sticks of gum. And they're like, Gen Z is just too lazy. They're like fucking financing their entire life on like a part-time salary. I'm like, okay. Hi, Arcane. I play East, West, Central. I'm like on a massive losing streak. This sucks. <sighs> Can you turn into Netspend Creator of Music? Sure. It's okay. I mean, I've been I've been live for almost two and a half hours. All right, I need to lock in and stop. I got stun locked in a conversation, and I've lost like five in a row. So, bro, if I get someone on my team named I'll get GC three one day, I'm crashing out. I'm telling you. I think I know who Jesse Reyes is. I think right now, I started this session at 17.23 and I'm 16.86, so I'm down like 40, like four games. What the actual fuck? Ban that person, ban who? Skibbity bar? Do I hear the music that plays on stream? Yeah, of course. Phoebe. Hmm. 
Uh, I don't think I have Meek Mill on my playlist. Do I? I used to listen to a little bit of Meek Mill, but not for a while. Y'all remember that Drake and Meek Mill rap beef? That shit was crazy. Good at Valorant to impress e-girls is outrageous. I've, Valorant is a really popular game. <laughs> I have seen people have like the... His, his kitten, her whatever. <laughs> so I believe it. Just in my net, I guess. Bye, Arcane. Get some sleep. Bro. Oh my god, fuck. <laughs> Can I play the game? I'm getting bullied. I'm the GOAT. Two, 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 two. Nah, we're good. We're good. His pitcher, her catcher is crazy. Her hole and his strap on, bro. I've seen some really shameless Valorant fucking IGNs. I cannot lie. Bro, I've been getting fucking bullied with these bumps and demos. Holy shit. Alright, locking in for overtime. Nice. I don't mind getting demo there. My team in possession. That's not a good touch. That might be really bad. Bro, actual fucking demo merchant. Jesus Christ. Holy fuck. I, I, think, I think they actually demoed like 50 times that game. <laughs> Unlucky. If I could be immortal... The Valorant rank? I should have got that demo. Damn, I just can't fucking, I can't even buy a win right now. Not happening, Christina. If I do, I'm not playing with you, because fuck you. 
you are you cheering what rank is this probably higher than you probably a lot higher than you like just percentage and statistic wise unless you're saying that like in a good way then i'm sorry i didn't mean it and that was toxic of me but if you're saying that like in a bad way Then I meant it. My teammates seem way slow. What rank are you, if, if I might ask? I just lost to him last game, Beckage, in overtime. You're champ three? Okay, yeah. So, the rank that you're watching right now is, like... What rank is champ three in 2v2? Like 1300? Is that champ three? This is, like... 400 MMR higher. Right? A whole rank higher. <laughs> A whole, like, rank icon higher. I feel like in general, Rocket League is just like, yeah. Rocket League's a lot slower to uh, watch than actually play too. I guess. I mean, I've been playing Rocket League since, like, 2017. That's where I'm heading right now, Christina, I guess. Did my teammate just get bumped and then call... Then type in chat pig. That's crazy. It's being toxic. <laughs> One crash out per game. Everybody knows the rules. Damn, I got that demo. That would have been a GG for us. Maybe? Bro, what the fuck is that? What the fuck?
bro. Uh, some people, bro. This motherfucker's name is I'll get GC3 one day and he's crashing out. Jesus Christ. Yeah, that was laggy as hell. Uh, Rocket League is comparable to like hockey, I guess. Do I fuck with the song? Yeah, I'm rocking with it. Yeah, right, Christina. I used to love Halo. I've beaten Halo 1, 2, 3, ODST, Reach, and 4. All on Legendary. Alright. But yeah, Ro Rocket League is definitely... That's probably most comparable to hockey with like the bumping and stuff. And demos. My fucking god. Minus 60 now, unfortunately. I can't even fucking touch the ball right. Holy shit. I'll just keep getting demos until we win. Eventually I'll demo enough that there's an open net, right? Jesus fucking Christ, bro. Ah. Uh... Up sash, bro. Yeah, there you go, see? Enough demos and we score. Why is Rocket League comparable to hockey and not soccer? Because you can't like fucking truck stick people in in soccer? And there's like no backboard in soccer. There's like no, in hockey you also have like a, a thing that like the ball, can, the puck can actually like bounce off of. There's no, there's nothing like that in soccer. The only thing that Rocket League has similar more to soccer is the ball. Can't or won't? If you truck stick someone in soccer, then you're going to get like a red card. So yeah, can't if you want to play by the rules. It's all about the demos, bro.
indoor soccer. I mean, yeah, true. But even still, shares more similarities with hockey. Calling it soccer is making me sick to my stomach. I was a football player for most of my life, yeah. Bro. That was like the the worst possible thing. The worst. The worst of all the touches. The worst. Thanks for all the subs on YouTube, by the way. I appreciate it. Don't forget to like the stream and subscribe to the channel. Both of those things are very appreciated. Hmm. Yeah, I'm just fucking a bot today on my game. I think, all things considered, Rocket League's not, bro. Rocket League's not a one-to-one -to, -one to any sport, but I feel like it shares the most similarities with hockey compared to football. I don't know, man. Get me out. The football war is up. I didn't even start that bad. Why am I doing so bad right now? How do I play this game? I'm ignoring you because it's funny you're Cole Wilson. Sorry. Joke's over. What rank did I air dribble? I don't know. 20 losing streak? Yeah, no, that would be crazy. Yeah, that definitely wouldn't make things way worse. That would help for sure. Ever play foosball? Hell yeah. Oh, I wish I got that boost.
Nice. I don't know if I've ever lost 20 in a row before. 20 in a row would be crazy. Wait, really? There was an actual war that was somehow st like started or instigated by football. That's kind of insane. Are you cooked? Just got to keep playing. I'm getting close. Bro, I've like lost not even 10 in a row right now. What is close to you? Maybe think before you speak, dumb fuck. Sorry, that was mean. That was that was aggressive. My fault. On me. I want to get Sparking Zero at some point, but not 70 bucks. Sorry. Yes, and that's why you got it. It was deserved, which is why I dished it out. I fear it may be time to end stream and go to bed. You like her, Kyla? I don't know. That kind of makes sense. Can I like just get a win before I get off, please? Yo, peace out, Wilkin. Have a good one. save dude I'm gonna vomit I don't know why my game played the vault so hard today You're gonna drag Christino down. Don't drag don't drag my twin down. I don't know, man. I'm, I'm gonna get off, I think. Well, you sure are, Tay, you sure are. I don't know. I don't want to play anymore. That was horrible. I just had no fun. I quit. All right. I'm hopping off. Don't forget to like the live stream on YouTube. And don't forget to subscribe. But I'm going to be going to bed. I am, I am too sick and not playing good enough to warrant staying on. 
demo karma. I know your ass is the plat one saying that. It's all good. I'll be... I'm hoping I feel better tomorrow. It really sucks being sick, dude. Like, every time I get sick, I always think about what it was like when I could breathe normally. The good old days, you know? The good old days. It's okay. I, I hopefully will feel better tomorrow. I think I think like one or two more good nights of rest and I'll be I'll be feeling feeling good. Cause I, I like was first starting to get sick on Sunday and I didn't feel worse today, so I think I've already, I'm already through the worst of it, so can you say girl boss? Yeah, of course, duh. Okay. Well, I'm hopping off. I got a nice little three hour stream in. Not as long as I normally stream, but at least, you know, three hours is not bad. I'll take it. Now I can take a shower and, and chill for the rest of the night. Okay. Bye, YouTube. Love you. Appreciate you. Don't forget to, to like and subscribe and all that stuff. I'll see you next stream at some point tomorrow, probably. Bye. Okay, now it's your turn, Twitch. Um, this is very dry. Thanks, Callus. By the way, that's okay. I'll f I'll feel better. I I'm thinking I'll wake up feeling better tomorrow. I'm literally gonna. My plan is to. I'm gonna end stream. I'm going to go take a shower and stuff and then probably probably pop some NyQuil. That's the plan probably. I'm thinking I'll feel better when I get up. Get some more more sleep. I need it. 16 ounces. No, I think I'll take the recommended dose probably. Probably take the recommended dose, but hey, maybe you never know. Either way, show Ryan some love. You know the drill. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Bye.